Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda, you come a waltzing Matilda with me. My name is Lisa. I was born and raised in Melbourne, and I'm a very proud patriot and a very proud Australian. I love this country and I will do anything to protect this country. My name is Kimberly and I'm from South Gippsland. I'm here in Melbourne, a beautiful Melbourne, celebrating my very beautiful Australia Day and I'm proud of it. My ancestors that yeah, built this country. It's a day that um, Captain Cook came to Australia and colonised it. I don't like being called a racist. Uh, today I've been called white trash just for having this sign. I've got friends from all over the world. If you are an Australian citizen and you love this country just as much as I do, damn straight you should come in and celebrate it with, the, with your fellow Australians. Dubby Dicks, appreciate what you have in this country. Appreciate what we are doing for you. Aussie, 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 oi, oi, oi. If you come here, just accept our culture and our laws, and that, that includes Aboriginal culture. My grandfather and elders from, at the time, help erect this monument here, you know? Yeah, um, paying honour to the 38 nations and, and there's ancestral remains here, buried. Yeah, my name's Jida Gopalil. Yes, yeah, so I'm Yori Yora, Jar Jar Rung and Dudaroa. I call it Invasion Day. Invasion Day or Survival Day. My name's Marcia Leg, and I'm a proud Gunditjmara woman. Victoria, 43 kills. You internalise a lot of stuff prior to today. You just feel this sense of sadness, this mourning, this loss. And then obviously with today um, coming about, um, it really brings to fruition those feelings. You just can't help but take your mind back to what this day would have been like. That impact was, was um, very volatile, you know, for our people. And, and um, it's a really bad history, you know, from that time. And um, it's something that we don't celebrate. Uh, my name's Peter Clifford, I'm uh, from Melbourne. I don't celebrate per se, no. In reality, January 26 to a lot of people, and probably me included, means a public holiday. I will go and have a barbie with my friends, have a, a beer. Oh gosh, the summary of why we call it Invasion Day. Sure. Because that's the facts, that Aboriginal people inhibited this land far beyond the date that it was so-called claimed through Captain Cook. And we survived off so this today, land without this any morning, of his um, means uh, or medicines shot. or guns or violence. And we looked after this land and we nurtured this land and we lived off the land and we looked after each other in a very peaceful um, governing way between each, each clans. And then this day he came in and took all that away dispossessioned us of this land, our family, our culture. And then on top of that, tried to cover it all up and pretend it didn't happen. So that history that we had, he essentially tried to take that away, the English settlers. So this is why it's Invasion Day. And because still to this day, people don't realise the impacts. Changing the date and having a date that we all can celebrate together. To do that, we need to educate more people. We need to use these opportunities, um, whether we like it or not, to do ceremonies like this, you know? On a day like today. 
it saddens me to see a lot of the conflict that is going on about Australia Day. It would be much better to actually have a lot more harmony in Australia Day. The white settlers here in Australia did wrong by them. I think changes in the waters, I do. I think this is why events like today are so important. I hope that this day, January 26, I guess I'd want that abolished of what that day means. And I hope that one day that that does happen and we can all come together and celebrate and recognise each other peacefully. Become more aware, you know, um, learn about the history, the true history. My name is Kimberly and this is my home, Australia. My name is Lisa and this is my home. My name is Marcia Legg and this is my home. My name is Peter Clifford and this is my home. My name is Jida Golpalil and this is my home in Victoria. I'm Victorian Aboriginal. <laughs>